So, yeah. right. so we're gonna put a button on on Liam. Yeah. And uh, real quick, I just want to talk about Jesse. Jesse. Uh, now I was trying to shoot this nigga some bell. I was Bussy trying to. Jesse. We ain't never get those buttons. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Oh. Wow, wow, wow. Hatch, Jim Hatch, Desperado, Rough Riders. Now you don't want none of this, none of this. <laughs> yeah. God you damn. have got <laughs> to relax. <laughs> <laughs> So Jesse, right? <laughs> I was trying to show some empathy for the situation, but then as the weeks go on, it's showing that this story is becoming more and more bullshit because the persons of interest that they had at first, they turned out to be some homeless people that weren't even near him, right? Yeah, it's Randall and Mortimer. <laughs> now, <laughs> now they're saying that they found the store where Jesse actually purchased the rope from. And then I, I don't know if this is true. This may be a joke. Oh, shit. A, this, this may just be a joke that's going around. But they said the um, investigators went to Jesse's house and they found like the subway wrapper of the, of the <laughs> shit he was buying. And then um, what else happened? Um, what? <laughs> um, I just typed out. I'm, just listening. I'm listening. And then he's he, he <clears throat> won't give up his phone to um the detectives that are working the case so it's like it seems like he's hiding something he's probably so got some booty in there no no fuck it <laughs> fuck it no <laughs> so gta online cheetah o's take two now go back now go back honestly I'm that's why i wouldn't say, come on let's be real that's why i wouldn't give up my phone come on man no come on Hmm. What are, what, Come on, man! I don't Come even on, know what to we say. gotta be real. What are we talking about? Oh, we talking about Jesse? I'm talking. What are you saying? I'm, I'm talking. I'm, I'm, I'm saying he will. He won't give up his phone yes. because there may be some call records or something where this was planned and this was orchestrated somehow. I'm not talking about no naked dick pics or some he shit. He probably do got that on. That's why. Nah, we're not even. talking about that. <laughs> hey, that doesn't matter. <laughs> that's just a reason. No, that doesn't even matter because we already has nothing to do with he's gay. Everybody knows. Yeah, so it's not the fact that he's gay. Gay has nothing to do with this shit right now. No, nothing. No. I'm saying if he had that on his phone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Homosexuality has nothing to do with this right it now. It's, it's a it fa- it's a false uh, police report. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And and I was I only saying say- he's not giving up his phone, and it seems suspicious that he's not giving up his phone to detectives that are working the case. Yes. And I was only going to say why would that be? Because people already know. No. So like if it so was, people have oh. a suspicion of yes. this may be some bullshit. Let me see your phone. He says no. So now they had to get a subpoena to go get the phone yes. so they can look through the phone and find out what the fuck happened. So this, again, and I said when we talked about it the first time, I was like, <laughs> something seems off and I don't know what it is. It just doesn't feel right. Now they're saying like, okay, they're doing their investigation. <laughs> they're like, all right, look, we're going to treat you like a victim. We done had a show today. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to treat you like a victim. <laughs> But if what? we discover some shit, we're gonna definitely charge you with some false reports. Yes, like saying that he had he had a uh, broken ribs and he he changed that claim. Yeah, it's like I don't know. That, and, it, and then he had that concert. And yeah, we, again, I didn't see where where he had cue cards. Yes, he was reading, the he shit reading off like, of cue cards. If so, why would you have to read it off of cue cards? You can't you yeah. can't you can't explain hurt off a of cue card, but nigga, just right. see what happened. And then so then I asked the question, and again, this is why the. The homosexual thing. We know that you're gay. Do I have to queue it up? No, no, no. It's just like, no, 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 no. It's just like, nobody cares if you're gay. It's just a normal thing. Yes, we know that you're gay. So, what would happen that you felt the need to have to lie about? Whatever the situation yeah. is, I mean, there what were, could we, what there, could possibly have happened? There were a whole bunch of reports like he was promoting music, maybe, or like you know, whatever the case. I don't know. Yeah, because I, I saw somewhere. I guess he had a music video where that came out where he had a noose, noose around his neck yeah. in the video. Mm-hmm. Nigga, why do you think that making a false police report was the right idea to do that? If that's what this is, <laughs> that's that's a hell of a marking strategy, right? Yeah. Like that's what I'm saying. So it's like that's what it, that's why Terrence Howard put you in that trash can. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh, but I'm a wild one, yeah. trash ass nigga. <laughs> yeah, allegedly, allegedly, we don't know.